Fish Creek. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, I'm honoured to be here today to share our thoughts on Black History Month. We take time to reflect on the contributions of black Canadians and Albertans to the society we live in today. We recognize someone like John Ware, who, it was, who has a junior high school named after him in Calgary. There are so many people we could re recognize and the huge impact that they've had on people's lives. Black History Month actually started as only one week, nearly 100 years ago. February was selected because of the birthdays of two great leaders, Frederick Douglass and Abraham Lincoln. We owe Black History Month to one man, Dr. Carter Woodstone, Woodson. As a child, he worked in coal mines, not starting high school until he was 20. He seized the opportunity and finished high school in only two years. He continued his education and earned a PhD from Harvard. Dr. Woodson was disturbed by the absence of black Americans and their contribution to society and American history. Not only did he spend a week for black history, he started a scholarly journal as well. Canada has a proud place in black history. Canada was instrumental in helping the black Americans escape the terror of slavery through the Underground Railroad. While we must be aware of the past, we must firmly look to the future. And the most inspiring words are familiar to all of us from Martin Luther King. I have a dream that my poor little children will one day live in a nation where they will not be judged by the color of their skin, but by the content of their character. Thank you.